Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Bobo Gates. I create beauty and lifestyle content amongst other things that will include story times. So you are very much welcome to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to have your natural hair, your natural African hair, look in this proper, okay? Yeah, let's get into the video. I hope you guys will enjoy it. Okay, so guys, this is me, okay? This is not crust. If you were to meet me in person, this is the girl that would show up. <laughs> yeah, okay. Firstly, we need to moisturize our hair. And to moisturize our hair, we, we use water water yes we use water ah uh, just spray water on your hair not too much not too little your inner designs are go guys but it's fine also you're going to need any hair food of your choice apply it on your hair focusing more on the ends of your hair if you see me looking that side I am actually looking at the mirror yeah I hope it's not a problem okay now my hair is moisturized so I'm going to go in with a comb and comb my hair Goa in Elizabeth, you guys, but it's fine. Um, now that my hair is combed, I'm going to go in with a styling gel. You can use any styling gel of your choice, but I chose this one black cheek styling gel because uh, it doesn't damage my hair and it doesn't leave those white things on my hair when it's starting to dry up. Okay, so I'm going to rub it on my fingers and apply it here in the front and do the same thing in the back. You see? Yeah. The whole point of putting this styling gel is for your hair for your edges to look proper even if they are not proper also you're going to need a toothbrush an old toothbrush or a toothbrush that you don't use for your teeth okay <laughs> okay so you are going to brush your edges backwards gradually going up Uh, also do the same thing at the back okay so you see now my hair looks proper and then you're going to need a piece of wool make sure that it's long enough okay And then you tie it on your hair I love putting it like this and not in the front because it's easier for me to tie my hair when it's like this and hold it like this hold it like this then put your your thumbs under the wall like this and pull it up while you make sure that it's very tight here pull at the back as well now 
then you tie it very tightly don't hurt yourself though but make sure that it's tight enough okay so now that my hair is tied up I'm going to go in with a comb and comb yeah to make it look more fluffy and very puffy yeah now it look proper okay and now it's time to lay our edges and i use this brush this is a makeup brush anyway but i use it for my hair to lay my edges so firstly i'm going to put some styling gel at the back of my hand running out oh my gosh okay there so I'm going to uh, dip the brush into the starting jaw and apply it on my edges it's really up to you how you want your edges laid but as for me, I will try and do some baby hairs. Even though I know they are going to turn out very imperfect. But, yeah, I will try. Uh, okay. You can also use a toothbrush for this, but I prefer this brush because, yeah, it's easier. <laughs> it makes it easier. Okay, we don't need this wool here. We have to cut it. Uh, I'll do the same thing this side. Okay, then I'll take the rest of the styling jewel and apply it at the back of my head, on my hair. Okay. There. Okay. Yeah, now my hair looks just like me. <laughs> okay, so after laying my hair back, I need to cover it with a scarf or a duke. It's really up to you what you're going to use. Ah, uh, I don't really keep track of time uh, in terms of how long do I wait for my hair to be laid back. I guess it just really depends on what am I doing, where am I going. So, I would say plus or minus five minutes, yeah. But in, in the meantime, let's have a drink. Sabawel, an adult beverage. Got a good pig and because. Level 3 of lockdown decided to have an entanglement with level 5. Hmm. So for now, Fanta will do. Mm -hmm. 
okay so that was it from me today i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and drop your comments down below i would love very much to hear from you i'll see you on my next video bye bye